Hi guys, I am Casey and this is Jason and we are the new owners of Mayhurst. We just arrived, how many days ago? 53 days ago, we got here with our caravan, four kids, many of goats, and we arrived on the property <laughs> and it's been a whirlwind. We're actually coming to you from the cupola, 65 stairs up and four stories tall. You can see, you can see the ridge behind us. And it has been an amazing journey so far, but we've really wanted to give you guys an update because we know so many of you are following us and have just been so encouraging to us and we've been so thankful for that. So the first 10 days, we basically arrived. Uh, Jack and Pat, the previous owners, were giving us a course on how to run a bed and breakfast everything from cooking to cleaning to managing it and so that was exciting and then really from day one we were welcoming guests here and uh, so we've had about 50 guests stay those first three weeks and then all of a sudden the coronavirus hit and things just went silent <laughs> and so we had we had cancellations galore unfortunately um, but uh, we are encouraged at the work that we've been able to get done uh, with not having guests, although we prefer guests here. Uh, <laughs> but in the meantime, we've really been doing lots of renovations around the property. We wanted to kind of give you guys a little update as to what we've been tackling. Yeah, so uh, Jason and the boys, they uh, gutted out the Magnolia Cottage. They mm -hmm. tore out the walls, the ceilings, everything. Just total overhaul on that. That's going to be a two-bedroom cottage. And it's going to be super sweet. It's surrounded by these huge magnolias. It's gorgeous. Um, and then the summer kitchen is the, the other thing they've been clearing out. And so they got everything out. And now they've cleared it down to the bare bones and mm -hmm. it's turned into mm -hmm. a homeschool room that for is. now. But that will be the original summer kitchen will become our family's home. And so uh, it's beautiful. I love it. Uh, and then we've also been working on the schoolhouse. So we did a big reno on that. So we painted the outside a cream and then are doing an old wood door for the front door and then we've redone the whole inside and Jason's almost done with the kitchen and uh, we're gonna be finishing it up here in the next couple days. That's a one bedroom cottage and that's gonna be really sweet. We're gonna be planting all kinds of flowers and re-landscaping um, the next couple days as well. So uh, we also cleared tons of land and so that's fun. I love clearing land. Yes. Um, <laughs> so there's a, there's a pond on the property you can actually see uh, from the house now. So it's a beautiful, yeah, it's beautiful gorgeous. lily pond. Uh, we have a duck out there. There's blue herons and all kind of wildlife um, swarming mm -hmm. around the pond. So we're excited about everything. Also, if you've seen some pictures of the barn, the old uh, barn that was built in 1859, yeah. original house, we've been redoing that. And I've been crawling underneath there and <laughs> checking stuff out. But it's just been an incredible journey. And we just want to thank all of you guys for your support. Uh, just your comments and the ways that you have inspired us to just press on and uh, just continue on this journey. It's, it's really been encouraging for us to know that you guys are following and watching and uh, checking us out. So yeah. thank you guys a ton and we'll look forward to giving you more updates uh, in the future. Hey guys, I am Casey and this is Jason and we are the new owners of Mayhurst Estate. It is in Orange, Virginia. <laughs> Stop laughing. Ah, I can't do it. Hey guys, I am Casey. This is Jason. And <laughs> <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> We're not snuggling for Snuggle Illustrated. Just sit there. Good night. Oh golly. <laughs> Jason is on the rooftop. Casey has not climbed in too many windows. Okay. She has been she's been a good girl. Me on the other hand, I've climbed in and out of a lot of windows. You are gonna fall off of the roof. What if I do? Doesn't help that it's closing on me. Oh goodness gracious, we have so many problems. That didn't work. <laughs> <laughs>